The classification of subtle activities is the problem of determining the action of subjects in the video when the actions are related and often involve the interaction with the same object or objects. Hi, and welcome to our presentation. This is our team, Fernando, myself, Wasim, and our supervisor, Dennis. Human action recognition from videos is a hard problem, and solving it promises many rewards with applications, including video surveillance, gaming, and healthcare, to name a few. The complexity of the problem stems from the fact that an algorithm must find the location of a person and related objects and keep track of them over time. Current algorithms memorize context cues to determine the action being performed, which often results in low accuracy when deployed in real world applications, which was achieved. To begin with, we compiled a data set of four paired classes. Each pair is closely related and involves the use of the same object, which makes it hard to distinguish from the context cues only. We implemented, trained, and validated various models and conducted extensive experiments using those models and developed a model which achieved 79% accuracy on the validation set. The data set we compiled has more than 4,500 videos. Each video is 1.5 second or 90 frames long at 720p resolution. Each video is given one out of eight possible labels and we allowed the interaction with one out of four objects. The number of videos per class is balanced more or less as you can see on the right hand side. We developed seven models in total, five of which are going to be presented here. In model one, we downsampled the videos in the temporal dimension to five frames per clip and used a 2D convolutional LSTM model. In model 1b, we added an additional branch to model 1, which takes the objects detected by a pre-trained network to give more signal to our model. In model 3, we replaced the 2D convolutional LSTM layer in model 1b with a 3D convolutional LSTM. Model 4 moves away from LSTM layers by splitting the clip into five frames and then create five convolutional branches, one per frame. Model six has three branches, one per frame, one for object information, and one for pose key points detected by a pre-trained network. In our experiments, we found that model three is the best performing model in terms of classification accuracy. This is model three. With various metrics, we notice that the model is not equally accurate on all the classes, and this is normal given the fact that most of the actions are uh, some of their actions are harder to discern, and highlighting the fact that more work needs to be dedicated in this direction. The confusion matrix of model three, our best performing model, is presented on the left. On the right hand side, you can see Fernando performing some activities and model three identifying those activities. All right, we believe that a working solution to this problem can have many applications to defense and other industries, including automatic surveillance, automatic video labeling, human computer interaction, healthcare, and immersive solutions. We have investigated the subtle activity recognition problem and demonstrated a working solution which can be further developed for more activities. We demonstrated also that care needs to be taken in compiling data sets for this particular task. Next steps in further developing the current model involve the adoption of supervised contrastive learning, which has the potential of increasing the accuracy, especially among the paired classes. Another direction is to adopt transformer-based models. 
For the benefit of further investigation, results from this research, including the data set, the models, and the implementation software can be accessed uh, on a Google Drive shared folder, which is included in our report. Thank you.